Welcome everyone, this is Sunday, April 27th, 2008, and in this particular health vlog we're actually going to discuss why antiperspirants and deodorants from a traditional perspective are pretty dangerous and actually can cause cancer and have been shown in the research to do so. And then we're going to help empower you to choose a more natural product. But um, this has been known for several years and more recently it's been pointed out in several research journals, major medical uh, publications. And um, this particular article from New Scientist actually speaks about deodorants plus shaving are linked to breast cancer. Now, um, women like to shave their underarms here in the United States and many other countries, and when that occurs, that actually shaves off a couple layers of skin, and then from there, the chemicals, the parabens, the aluminum concentrates are uh, more easily able to penetrate into the underlying tissue and into the circulation of the body. So um, if you're going to use a deodorant, if you're going to use antiperspirant, there are far, far better alternatives to use. And this is another study by CBS News talking about the link between antiperspirants and breast cancer. And more so, it's the aluminum zirconiate compounds within there. So if you want to check your deodorant or antiperspirant at the moment, you can see that if it does have parabens, if it does have um, aluminum derivative uh, derived compounds in it, then you want to throw it out immediately because you're actually doing yourself more harm than good. And what I tend to use, I tend to use what's called the Thai crystal stone. And what that is, it's actually just a, a salt. It's, it almost looks like a rock. You can pick it up at Whole Foods Market or, or many uh, natural food markets. And basically, you just wet it a little bit, you apply it under the arm about 30 to 40 times, and you still will sweat and perspire. That's normal. We need to perspire. We need to release toxins. Um, but at the same time, there's no odor that's attached to it. It's absolutely incredible, and I'm, I'm, I'm very glad that I found it several, uh, several years ago. So that's just a very easy tip that you can do. Um, some other great brands that you can actually look up, Tom's of Maine, um, also Jason's Organic. They have some great uh, uh, compounds and uh, deodorants without aluminum derived products and also parabens and any really petroleum derived product is going to cause you problems it's going to stimulate the um, the estrogen receptors within the body and that's what they do they mimic these estrogen compounds within the body and then that really cause the hormone fluctuations to to go haywire so we want to definitely try and prevent that and um, as I mentioned before you can go to the store you can pick up the Thai crystal stone that's T-H-A-I crystal stone. I also mentioned uh, several other products that you can go ahead and purchase within my book, Cracking the Cancer Code. And what I've done in this particular book is I've listed a, a nutritional and vibrant health lifestyle reference. So whether they're hygiene products that you're looking for organic, natural uh, products, or whether they're meat, dairy, any food product, you can find it in there. And I've listed all the companies that you can go to for these particular products and many times you can actually order them uh, directly from the companies at a much less expensive rate. So it's cheaper so um, I tried to provide some uh, use value for you there and you'll get a lot of great information out of it. If you have any questions feel free to go ahead and contact me on my MySpace page. You can, you can definitely send me a message. My MySpace URL is myspace.com backslash A-L-L-P-R-O-C-H-I-R-O -L -L -R and my main mission is to help empower you to take back your health from those that are profiting from disease but in order to take back your health we have to become aware of certain things that are going into our body and it's not that we have to avoid everything it's just we have to choose safer alternatives now as I mentioned before with the deodorants and the antiperspirants much safer alternatives are ones that you can find uh, within my book Cracking the Cancer Code the products that I reference I already mentioned the Thai Crystal Stone Tom's of Maine and also Jason's Organic. So next time you're at the store, I know many times now, because the public demand has increased, you'll start to see your major chains like Kroger, Publix, and many others carry more of an organic selection, which is absolutely great, because as, obviously, public consciousness elevates, people are starting to realize that the products that they're getting are very toxic to the human body, not only the food, but also the hygiene products. And in America, uh, food and many products are produced in a separate, uh, distinct way that make them very toxic because corporations want to get the cheapest ingredients possible because they need to sell these products at a high profit. So they're always looking for ways to cut corners, but don't be fooled. Always do the research. Always look on labels and you're going to be uh, just very surprised what you find in many of these products. So I hope this weekly health vlog was actually helpful to you. And if you have any other questions, you can always type in 
uh, antiperspirant and breast cancer on Google. That will actually give you a lot of information. Or you can go to YouTube. You can visit my channel. My channel is Health Expert, H E A L T H E X P E R T, one word. And I have some phenomenal videos that are going to really help empower you. So, so again, I hope you enjoyed this weekly health vlog, and I'll look forward to seeing you on the next one. Thank you.